Hi, in today's video, I'm going to be talking about MailChimp and how you can use it as a free autoresponder and lead capture page. So let's get started. When you first go to MailChimp, you're going to see the products, resources, information, and most importantly, pricing. So let's hit that first. <clears throat> and the thing I like most about MailChimp is that it's free. Um, until you, up until you get 2,000 contacts, uh, you can then, you know, once you go over that limit, you can then upgrade to, you know, a higher level, which is, you know, 15, 10, 15, and uh, 300. <laughs> but um, this free level is very, very useful, uh, along with the landing page. All right, so let me show you inside what it looks like. All right, so when you log in, this is what you'll see. On the left-hand side is the dashboard, create, audience, campaigns, automations, website, content studio, integrations, and search. So let's start with create. So you can always create your uh, and design your email. You can also design your landing page and you know other other email templates. But the one that you'll probably be dealing with the most is the landing page. So let's go ahead and look into that. And then you can go ahead and select from a whole wide range of modern templates. Um, the one thing I have to say right off the bat is I haven't really seen a, a video video template, but I'm pretty sure you can make it now. So let's go with the uh, oh, and the other new thing is that you can accept now accept payments uh, with your lead generation, right? So let's go with this landing page, a simple landing page right here. And as you can see, it's a completely web-based platform. So the good thing is you can go ahead and create whatever however you want or whatever you want and, um, you know, use, you know, use whatever, whether you're a tablet or mobile or windows or Mac, it works on multi-platforms. All right, so basically on the right-hand side, they kept it simple for you. You have text, uh, box text, dividers, images, image groups, image card. You have uh, payment. You have video. Okay, there you go, video, um, button, promo code, image text. So you have all these little, like, widgets that you can go ahead and, and incorporate into your, your page. And let's say I wanted the video. I can go ahead and drag it up here. Or here, or here. So it's it's very it's it's quite intuitive, right? So let's say I want it up here. All right, there you go, and I can always go ahead and uh, click on it to add a video if I like. If I don't, I can go ahead and uh, delete it. All right. So let's go ahead and delete that. Um, here you can also you know change the different text and see what it looks like, and then you have your email and uh, you have different sections over here and your social media um, icons down here. So if you look at the the quality of the landing page, it's quite good considering that it's free, and it has to be good. In order, if you're uh, if you're gonna be you know paying a paid customer, they want you to do well, and you know they want you to get as many leads as possible so that you eventually upgrade. Which is not a you know it's a win win situation in my opinion. Um, so that's a good thing. They give you a free landing page with a uh, email autoresponder now and, and they also give you like a whole bunch of different customization options as you can see on the right hand side even the option uh, for payment but i had issues with this um i believe it only works in certain countries uh, at the time of this uh, recording so i would be careful with the payment option it's still quite new as well so that's that's with the that's with the landing page and with the email cap capture page, it's it's just like any other email capture page. But let me just talk about real quick with the, the downsides. Uh, <clears throat> okay, so when you go into your uh, audience, you can see who subscribed. And they'll give a first or last name if you have both. The email address and whether they're subscribed or not. And additional information if you asked for it. So this is just uh, the one I have right right quick is uh, you can see all the different types of um, you know, email addresses and you can always export your audience right that's always a, a added benefit now as for the the benefits 
So you have a free lead page. You have a um, really, really good uh, customizable uh, lead pa- landing page, and you know the you have up to two thousand contacts that you can store. The downside is that uh, the payment system is kind of uh, it's it's kind of finicky, and it doesn't work everywhere all the time. The other downside is that the terms and conditions within Mailchimp limits what audience you can market this to and at the time of this recording they're really against uh, affiliate marketing you know make money online type of <laughs> type of list all right so i built this list off of uh you know e-learning right? e-learning templates so you can also like use other lists as well but i, I chose to use this list um but, that, but that's the real downside to using MailChimp is that you have to be very, very aware of their term and conditions, and they're 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 kind of have really strict policies against affiliate marketing and make money online niche. So you really have to be careful of that. And if that's your niche, then I would maybe choose another um, another another provider, right? But they all pretty much have that, uh, from what I can tell, have that limitation, not just MailChimp, all right? So. All in all, I would rate this 8 out of 10. I mean, you get 2,000 free signups. You get a, a free landing page. Yeah, you, you don't have to pay for a domain or hosting. So I, I think all in all, it's a, it's a win-win for you and for MailChimp if you're able to develop a, a decent list. Um, so that's my take on it. I, I highly recommend MailChimp for anyone who's just starting off because, like, let's face it, when you're you're you know new to online marketing, you don't have you don't have even ten twenty dollars a month to to pay for just one part of your online business, like just the the autoresponder, right? Uh, which is what they charge in a lot of cases. Like Aweber, they'll charge maybe ten or twenty dollars just for the autoresponder and without and the landing page. Uh, but here you get you get both for free. So that that's really good for you know anyone who's starting out in this space, and I highly recommend uh, anyone who's not really focusing on affiliate marketing or uh, make money on online niche to go ahead and give it a try. Um, it, it's it's really easy to use, easy to pick up. There's not really much coding, and you don't really have uh, high overhead. There's no like ongoing cost until you reach a threshold, which is which is nice. All right, so I hope this uh, content was useful, and if it was, please hit that like button as it would really mean a lot to me. I would like to thank you a lot for that in advance, and uh, if you have any questions, please drop them in the comment section below. This is Vince from Digital Nomad Institute signing off.